But I think we wanted to be a working foundation. We were going to run it. We were going to run it in an entrepreneurial manner. We wanted to do a concentric geography. So we were already in a very small geography in, um, in, in Maharashtra, in, in Raigarh. Raigar. So we decided we're going to grow from there. So the geography we occupy now is about 2,500 square kilometers in Raigarh, seven blocks, about a million people. And what is it that you're doing? So essentially, it's a 360-degree model. We take all of the villages, and we look at the holistic model. We solve for water, sanitation, health, education, but most important, livelihood. So we look at our one-line KRAs on each of them. Is Water means two taps in each household and 365 days of drinking water. An attached toilet that they will use, not just that it's there and used in storage. In health, we took three of the largest coefficients. For us, it was anemia, health, and the prenatal and postnatal care. And in education, it was not going out and building our own schools. We don't believe in overcapacitizing the infrastructure, but work with those schools from teacher training to career counseling to maths. So in every curriculum, we input on that. And our benchmark was that 100% of the kids would complete the 10 standard, 100% would pass the 10 standard, and a minimum of 50% would pass in first class. And on all these, the, the, the baselines were about 50% or 40% of where we had set our goals. So we did our baselines when we started in there. But all of this leads to creating livelihood, where for us to have an exit strategy, and we started using the word exit, and then we had to change it quickly to empowerment because everyone thought exit means we're going to abandon them. They're saying, you're coming here for three years and they're going to abandon us. And what we want to say is, no, we're there till you need us, but we don't want to be needed for more than five to six years. But the best way you can do that is to, to put money in their pockets because actually nothing is changing unless you can bring some self of self-confidence to your own self. And the only way you can do that is by making the family feel that they're in control of their, their own destiny, which they're not in right now. The only way we can do that is if they have money in their pocket. But what we've realized in one of our deepest learnings is that most people that don't have financial literacy don't even know what money can do to them because they've always been on dole or glance or whatever else. So at every given stage, the challenges have been incredible. But the reason why I think we've succeeded in many parts along the multiple, multiple learnings and failures that we've had is that we, every day we've learned and we've been able to pivot because we're there on the ground. We're there on the ground. We have a 350 people full-time staff. 